what is going on guys welcome back to another video today's video is going to be a little bit different a little bit interesting we're dealing with a couple of things a we do have the batteries hopefully all charged up so we can get the dually fired back up and then on another note we're going to be dealing with one of the unfortunate things you sometimes have to deal with as a property owner i've had to deal with this several times now never usually to an extent that it gets like actually taken to like a court of law or prosecutions or anything but just to an extent that I have to make it very obvious and very clear to people, I don't want them trespassing onto my property. Now, normally with my other properties, I would have already had them heavily posted by now. And I get it. There's some people that are torn about that. And they're like, oh, you know, heavily posting a property is like how you make bad neighbors, whatever. Well, when neighbors are trespassing or neighbors to your neighbors are going through both your properties just to come trespass, um, it's just not cool, okay? So you kind of already are making a bad neighbor there by not just asking permission to be on the property, but instead just doing it and being like, well, I thought I would just do it because nobody's ever run me off before. You're, you're still trespassing. Now, to their defense, until I have posted signs up, you know, it wasn't posted. So that's what I'm doing today is gonna be part of the process, but let's get into this video and hopefully you guys enjoy it. five-speed manual here that you can actually enter to win and 20 times entries do end on Sunday so if you want to get 20 times entries you're almost out of time and uh what bonus are we running for them right now 20x 20 no not that the promo code we're not even going to tell you check the description for our current promo code offer if you check your emails you check our stories if you keep up with us on social media and stuff and the stuff that we send out you might have this in the bag because you get the best promos and you actually read that stuff so uh, well, let's get this thing fired up. We got the batteries on triple charger for two days in a row now. Um, did the one for 24 hours, then I did the next one for 24 hours, just because triple charging just kind of takes forever. And I wasn't going to try to jump it because these batteries must have been so drained from something being left on for two weeks when we were gone that a, a simple jump wasn't going to do it. These things are like toast dead. So now that we are done resolving the issue from my son killing the truck and flipping all the freaking lights and everything on the thing before we left, Get this thing to fire up and pull it out. <laughs> Are you ready, Bill? I'm so ready right now. All right, we're live. What's going on, guys? In the five-speed, shifting through the gears, passing passing yeah. people that are missing gears. We're going to go buy some posted signs. As previously mentioned in the beginning of the video, we're having to deal with a lot of trespassers, and they're trespassing for a very sacred, expensive resource on my property we're not going to tell you what it is exactly but it's a very rare and pricey item lots of them that people are raiding my property and taking off my property before i can get out there and get to them so we're going to go here we're going to grab some signs hopefully this place has the ones that i'm looking for i'm wanting some like really scary ones that are like you trespass i'm going to shoot you type deal even though i would actually do that. 
I would like to at least make it known that that could be a possibility. So, hopefully they've got what we're looking for here. And holy horse turns. Goodness, dude. Just ran over like The that. Amish do. They just, so many they have no respect for these roads. And the beautiful second gens. Especially dualies. They pick up twice as many turns in the rear end, bro. <laughs> it's bad. But I just wanted to also get a little, little clip of shifting gears in the five speed because other than the original day picking it up and kind of trying to get a video i never really got a video and i know that there's just a there's a good handful of you out there that just appreciate a nice simple video of just shifting gears in the five speed so let's get a nice shot of shifting gears once we take a turn up here We had to get like the message across this road because we aren't just like talking about anything. We're talking about freaking morel mushrooms, dog. And these fools raiding my property every day. Dude, I went back there in the pouring rain. There's people back there sneaking through my woods. I went back there on a nice evening. People sneaking through my woods. Just one thing. It's just the same sort of thing. The point is, I'm sick of people stealing, stealing my mushrooms. So not only did I get these, I've also got a bunch of AA batteries. I'm going to be replacing all the batteries and all my truck cameras. I'm going to be putting them on video mode. And they're all cell cams. So if you happen to be one of the people trespassing, I will have them high enough. You ain't going to be able to grab them. And I'll already have the video anyway. So if you've analyzed my cameras, I'll just have a video of you and proof of it. And it, it ain't going to matter. So anyways, um, we're going to go back there. We're going to set these signs. We're going to post the living crap out of this place. The whole back of it is going to be covered in these signs and put some cameras up in these areas where a, it could kind of be convenient for a deer trail, but also we're just looking for trespassers at the same time. And why? Really just because I just, I just want to prove. It's not that I'm actually going to like prosecute any of these people. Like, I'll be honest, like I don't really care that much, but it's just really annoying when like we were literally back there yesterday and I'm looking and I'm like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, I just really appreciate it if nobody... Like cross my fence. What were these fools doing? They were literally like walking on the fence, looking. I'm like, dude, I'm like, I'm standing ten feet from these this lady. She's like, oh no, we we won't cross the fence. And she's like looking around, lo looking around into my property, like she's trying to find mushrooms on my property. I'm like, you're telling me if I wasn't standing here, you would just walk across and do all this looking and searching, and you seen a bunch of mushrooms, you would just step across the fence and grab them all real quick. Line sex. I mean, Ty was with me. Oh, were, yeah. they, were they not literally walking the line? They kept like they moving. were. They were like leaning over the fence, like looking around. And the fence is like beat down to the ground. It's like knee high, so you could just step over. It's not like it's keeping anybody out. I mean, they were pushing it, you know. I mean, and they came out of the neighbor's property. They mm -hmm. were clearly on the neighbor's property, and then they were just getting ready to walk through mine too. And then they saw me there, so then they just kind of like skirted around to where they knew the property I was just around. Like they know where the line is. But they were just, you know, pretending they were going to play it safe just because I was standing out there. But it was just kind of like, 
really annoying. And then she's like, oh yeah, there was a there was a girl and a and her boyfriend out here. They were standing back here the other day and we were talking to them and they had just sacks full of mushrooms. They had tons of them and we're like, oh man, you guys picked them all. And they're like, oh yeah, we've got so many back here. And I'm like, go back to my own property. There's like boot tracks, stuff beat down. I mean, you can just see stems where there were big mushrooms that people have already picked them all out through my property. And I'm thinking like, just so frustrated. So we're gonna go post the crap out of this right now. One of them in a fat tree, like looking at the sign, see what people say. Should I? I think it's a good idea. I should. Oh my God, I'm totally gonna do that. Nothing like some bark in your eyes. Dude, I take my mushrooms serious, bro. These people better not mess with me. It's also just a really good deer trail. Like honestly, like the fence stops right here from the neighbors. It's a perfect crossing. This is honestly probably where that. One freaking nice buck. I kept getting pictures of him on the camera, literally right there. Mm -hmm. He's probably cutting here because I kept getting pictures of him walking past. Probably sneaking through here. I'll probably just leave this one here regardless. It's probably a good rut location. No, we're pretty good at this. Yeah, we're not done yet. We gotta get the message. On to the next. Moral of the story, respect to the people's property, Read my mushroom signs. <laughs> Don't touch my mushrooms. <laughs> now, all seriousness, I didn't have the property posted, so there's probably just people thinking, no posted signs, no problem. And I totally get that. Usually people who are real sticklers about trespassers, usually they have signs up and I didn't have any up. I am a real stickler about it, but I didn't have any signs up. So no harm there because, you know, you know, people that have been going back there for years and the previous landowners, maybe they just didn't mind. Now they know. And I've had to talk to lots of people already back there and uh, the message will get out. And it's just one of those things, and I get it, you, there's some guys out there that they like to own ground and they either inherited ground or they bought ground just because they wanted it for the value of having land, but they don't actually like care if people do whatever they want on their property. For me personally, like the reason I want to own ground is so I can actually reap the benefits of having to pay to own ground. Like if I didn't want ground, I would just get a way cheaper place with way less land on everything else and just not pay for it. But I pay for it because I, I enjoy it. So it's one of those things where it's like, I would just kind of like to be able to go with my family and enjoy my property and not have to worry about competing with all the neighbors. And apparently people that travel in, you know, that, that aren't paying for the ground, they're just going through everybody else's properties and, you know, helping themselves. Um, but yeah, it's, it's freaking mushrooms. It's not that big of a deal. but. I thought it'd be fun. We did really put cameras up there. I'm, I'm interested to see what happens. We, we're totally gonna use some of the footage. If we get some funny videos of people reading the trespassing signs, we put like cameras facing the signs, it'll be cool and hilarious to get some of these reactions. So, all that being said, guys, if you wanna get entered to win this beautiful 1997 Dodge Ram 3500 12 out comes with a five speed manual transmission that comes with $5,000 in cash, with only 99,000 miles on it, and it's a four wheel drive truck. It's a mouthful. Essentially, it's freaking awesome, super clean. 
Um, if you want to get entered to win this truck, lmpgear.com, every $1, 20 entries to win until this Sunday. 20X is gone. Giveaway for this truck overall, the last day you can enter is May 21st. So we are coming up on that pretty quick here. We've got just hardly two weeks left and then uh, giveaway's gonna be gone. So thanks so much guys for all the love and all the support. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.